They all came in this bright orange looking bag. It says Timu on it and it has a fragile sticker. The first item I purchased were these stainless steel loops. And there are a thousand pieces in here. I believe these are about five millimeters. I've opened these up a little bit, but they're in very good quality. They're already pre-opened. If you're making jewelry, it makes it a little bit easier. I really like these. I'll be purchasing these again. Um, they were a thousand pieces and they were $2.49. The next item I received were these little head pins jewelry making um they arrived some of them were if you can, as you can see they were bent in the package so they're very thin um i wouldn't say they're the highest quality but they do work and they will work for me um they're showing it says 50 mm 100 pieces but it looks um they're pretty decent to make earrings out of. I'm gonna go ahead and use those. I don't know if I will be repurchasing those, but they are $1.79 for 100 pieces, which I think is a pretty good deal. The next item I got was also for jewelry making. Let me see if I can find those for you. Give me just a moment. Um, these are the little backings to the earrings that you make the little plastic. They are a bit smaller than what I am normally get. I don't think I would prefer these very, very small because they're kind of hard to pick up when you're putting in your earring. They will work, but I might not get these in the future, but they're, you do get a lot of pieces. It's a thousand pieces and they were only a dollar seven for this whole Thing and they come in this cute little jar. Okay. Then I also got another jewelry item. These are the little um, silver backings. Like I had the plastic backings and then these are silver ones that you can glue on to make earrings. They're very small. Um, it says they're five millimeter and there's a hundred pieces and they look to be pretty good quality i like those a lot and those i paid a dollar 79 the next item i got was um these cabochon pendant earring set and they were three dollars and 23 cents Um, looks like there's probably about 20 in there. There's a bunch of little pendant plates. There's some pendant plates. They look pretty good condition. And there's some little glass um, beads to put on. They look kind of domed. They're very cute. And then they came with the little fish hooks. And then some more of these little rings to put up to make your jewelry. And they all came in this cute little plastic case. Which I love these little plastic cases. They make it so easy for you to do different things. Okay, on um, the next item I got are these butterfly charms. They come in this little baggie. This little Ziploc thing and then there's this other little plastic bag in the middle. And they have gold on the back of it. And it's kind of like a little pinkish color. They're very cute. They have like a shell kind of. It says these are rose red. But I've noticed on their website, anything that says rose red is more of a pink. 
So I'd be leery if you ordered anything with a red. But they're very cute. You can make little earrings or pendants with those. Okay, the next item I got were some little flowers. I just thought these look so cute and I haven't seen anything like this. Um, they're little flower, they're like flat back. There's a couple different sizes in here. And they're very glittery. The larger ones you could probably use to make some kind of earrings. And then they have, they have a really, really tiny ones in here too as well. It looks like there's two different sizes from what I can see. Very, very tiny. And this one is purple. And it has like a glitter effect. And there's 50 pieces in the bag here. And I also got different colors. I'll show you the different colors I got. This next one is called a golden coffee. It's another really pretty color. And here's another one. They call this red, but it's actually more of a pink color. And then here is a blue. And those cost me $1.68 per pack, and each pack has 50 pieces in it. Okay. The next item I got is something I've been looking at on Amazon, but I never purchased because they were always kind of expensive, I thought. But I wanted to try it. This roll isn't very big, but it's on the nano tape. It's pretty thick. It's about the size of like a scotch tape roll. Um, you can see it pull up. There's only about four of these little rolls around the tape, but it's very sticky. And I just wanted to try it. It's 99 cents for this roll. Okay. And then I got these little, which I thought were really cute. I was hoping more came in this pack, but it doesn't look like a whole lot, but they're little kind of pastel moon and stars and they're very tiny they'd probably be more too small to make like earrings or anything out of it shows they're 50 pieces but they do look very small I can't I don't know if there's actually 50 in there I guess there are but it doesn't appear that way okay and the next item I got was to do, I have some UV resin that I work on, but I don't have one of the little flashlights. They just have the lamp. So I wanted to try a flashlight. It came in this little box here. And it, doesn't, it just kind of says made in China. It doesn't really give you information. But I wrote down that it said it had 21 LEDs from when I ordered on the website. But it's pretty what I expected size-wise. And there was another one that had less LEDs. I just picked the biggest one to see. But it, it appears a little bit difficult to unscrew. But you got to screw it in and then put batteries in it. But it is a little bit difficult. Okay. We'll have to test that out at a later date. Okay. And then I got a bunch of molds. First mold set I got was this jewelry mold. And it comes with different sets. There's a star, um, a heart, and like a square size earrings. Make a couple pairs of earrings with. And then these kind of have a little funky designs on those. And then here's a third pack that they gave me with different designs. And then it all came with um, those same kind of fish hooks and circles. There's a, two different sizes in here. These look about eight millimeter and then maybe four or five millimeter, the little hooks to make things with. So you could make earrings or keychains with them. This all came together as one set, and the set was a jewelry mold, and it was $5.39 for that set. Okay, and I'm going to go through a bunch of molds, because I did pick up a bunch. 
on this next piece. I'm sorry, that last mold was... I'm sorry, yeah, that was $5.39. This is an earring mold. This one was $7.99, and it comes with a lot of different cavities in it to make molds. And they're all these molds are all pretty good quality. They're pretty sturdy. And then this was I was excited to try. It's a big gigantic moon mold. Looks like it would make a tray. This moon mold was three dollars and forty eight cents. Okay. And then I found this donut mold. This only cost me $2.87. And I was actually just in Hobby Lobby the other day. And I believe these were like around $10 or more for one of these. And they were the same exact mold. This is very good quality. So that's a good place to get that one. And I got, I thought these were super cute. They were to make some earrings or something. They're little guitar molds and they came with a three pack. I got that little set there. Then we got this set of picks um, and inside some of the picks, if you can see, there's a sun. This one says, um, just rock it. And then there's like some fingers, little star. And then in the middle, there's a bunch of just plain ones. And then here's the last one that came with that set. And all of those molds together, these three were $6.98. Okay. And then this is something I was wanting to pick up at the Dollar Tree and I just seen it on there so I thought I would buy it. Um, it's I got it a little bit cheaper it would probably be like 10 cents more in my Dollar Tree, but this is just a little pump bottle. It was $1.16. All you do is lift the lid and you can push it down and you can put like a cotton swab on it. If you have like nail polish remover and I'm gonna use, I'm gonna put alcohol in mine to do some of my crafts with. But it's good quality what I expected. Um, and then I got a bunch of some nail foils. I'm not using these for nails. I'm actually going to be using these to do crafts with. But they're very, very cute. I have a bunch of packs of these. Let's see if I can get any of these. I think I opened one of these up. There's one that I opened up. This is like a leopard print. They come with 10 to a pack. Can see and they all got a little spot in there they're very good quality so I got that there's like a marbly looking one there and this has like some starry night marbly looking different designs this is a little bit interesting this is um black and white lace look let me see if I can take one of these out to show you better Has like a flowery look on that one. And this one's like a snake skin kind of design on that. And then I got six of these packs, and there's ten in each pack. Each pack of six is a dollar forty-eight. Okay. And I wanted to try looking for some kind of holographic. I did a search for holographic and this came up. So I wanted to try. These are kind of just a silvery color in there. That's what they kind of look like. But these don't come in a really cool case. They just come in the little plastic sleeve. And I got two of those and they were a dollar or seven for each pack. So that wasn't as a good of a deal. I don't think as these packs of 10 that you're getting. And then I also got, these are nail foils. They come in packs of two. There's a couple of different, they're like the abalone, but they look, um, 
There's a couple different designs in each pack. Let me put a close up on this one. They're very pretty. And those just, you get two little bottles in each pack. And those packs were 71 cents for two of them. Okay, and the last nail foil item I got were these Van Gogh nails, the Starry Night. And these come in a little pack for $1.18. They're very cute. They're like glittery looking. Okay. These I was super excited to see because I just think they're so cute. I've seen them all on the internet. But they're called Luminous Ducks and they glow. They're like a glossy color. And they look very good quality. You just need to put like an ear hook on them and you can make some earrings out of them. They're super cute. Let me put some of those up close so you can see them a little bit. There's a couple colors. They're very, very cute. I would recommend getting some pendants because it looks like they're very good quality. Okay. This next item I got was a 50 pack of acrylic blanks. Um, this one I wasn't super happy with because when I got the pack, I noticed a lot of them are like scratched up. There's some that are really bad scratched up in here. If you can see their scratches. And I believe if you buy them on Amazon, they come with some kind of film on the top of them. And these have no like protective film. They're just, they're all pretty scratched up. There's like um, squares and circles. And there's some little hearts in here there's different designs and they do have holes in them but uh, I wouldn't really recommend these because of how scratched up they are unless that's something that you can work with but um, they were a pretty good price I got 50 pieces for five dollars and 79 cents okay and these ones um, for some blank wood bookmarks that came in a pack of 20. These are really good quality. I don't see any kind of distress or marks on the wood or anything. I was expecting these to be a little bit smaller, but that's probably my fault for not reading that they were bookmark size. I was hoping they would be smaller, skinnier for like earrings, but those would be very good to do bookmarks on. So I'm very pleased with those. The last item I got, I just wanted to check their bead quality because I I like these little grayish beads. They were kind of what I was expecting, but I just wanted to see I can use those to make something. And they were $2.49 for this strand. And that is all of what I got. I'm going to link um, my link below, and it's temu.com. I noticed they offer free shipping. They have lightning deals where you can, if you find their lightning deal, it's probably the cheapest cost. The prices seem to go up and down and you can get discounts. You can watch for 30%, 40% discounts when you buy. Um, it seems to be a very good deal. I've already made another purchase and I will share that video when it comes out. Um, thank you for watching and I would appreciate it if you like and subscribe to the channel.